Hi grade fours, I'm going to explain to you what to do on natural, and sci natural science and technology for the 4th of June and we are doing strengthening materials. Okay, so let's start with a starter. What do we do with a starter? Do we answer in our books? No, we only do it verbally. Okay, so you answer for yourself. You say it with your mouth. Okay, so can you strengthen a piece of paper? Now think about a piece of paper just lying in front of you. Just a sheet of paper. Can you strengthen that paper? Can you do something with that paper to make it stronger? Now think a little bit. Okay, and then if you can, do you know how to do this? Think a little bit. It's difficult. How can you make that piece of paper stronger? Okay. Yes, you can strengthen it. You can fold it. If you fold a piece of paper, it becomes thicker. And the thicker it is, the stronger it is. Okay. We are going to do a test to test if it is stronger. And then making hollow pillars. Pillars are stronger than just the piece of paper. And then rolling it into struts. Okay, so now we're going to look at those examples. Okay, so the first one is folding. Okay, you can strengthen paper by folding. So if you bend it over and over and over itself, it becomes thicker and it becomes stronger. And then there's many examples in real life um, of folding. Have you ever torn a piece of cardboard? You will see folding inside. Okay. Even the outside of a cupcake, you know, a cupcake holder, it's also been folded to make it stronger. Okay, so there's examples of folding. Then we have hollow pillars. Hollow pillars, we get a square one, we get a triangular one, and we get a circular one. We are going to do an experiment where we t test which one of the three will be stronger. Will it be the hollow square or the triangular or the circular one? So start thinking which one do you think will be stronger. Okay, then the last one is rolling it into struts. So we um, take the piece of paper and we roll it into a thin strut. But you can join these struts together and make a frame. And that frame will be stronger. Okay, so in your books, strengthening materials is your heading. You can write 4th of June. You copy the summary about the three ways of strengthening materials. And then we have a very, very short activity. So let's quickly look at the activity. Okay, you can strengthen other materials or structures. So not just paper. You can strengthen other materials and you can st uh, strengthen other structures. Structures like, like buildings and things you can climb on. You can strengthen it with um, these this way. So you can also do folding, you can also do pillars and you can also join struts together to make a frame. Okay, so the, the activity, the instruction is... Match the picture with the way of strengthening. Okay, so we have our three pictures here. We have um, the metal sheets over there. We have uh, a jungle germ and silos. Okay, so you have to say you're going to write the numbers. One, two, three. Now folding is number one. Do you think an example of folding will be A or B or C? And then you just write the letter. Number two, hollow pillar. Which one is an example of a hollow pillar? Will it be A, B or C? And then the last one, stretch, join to make a frame. Is it A, is it B or is it C? Three questions. Very short activity. Okay, then a plenary, we answer verbally. Okay, so if you have to think, which of the above structures is an example of an hollow pillar?
Yes, you are right. It's the silos. It's a hollow pillar, but is it a circular pillar? Or a triangular pillar? Or a square pillar? What do you think? It is a circular pillar. Well done. Okay, so this is what you have to do and it's not a lot of work. Enjoy it.